This is a major cause for mid-course refinement cases. There are two models visible on the screen created from exactly the same optical scan for exactly the same patient. Both these models are models created by liner software for liner manufacturing, but the models are different and the teeth are in different positions. The yellow model is based on an optical scan with limited crown-only information as has been done for years. The red model is based on segmented CT teeth, true anatomical data. It is based on the calculations of the volume of each tooth for intelligent widget placement, much more accurately reflecting how the teeth will actually move in the patient's mouth. It is the difference between planning with limited crown-only information and estimations as to how the teeth will actually move versus full anatomical data, intelligent widget placement, and most importantly, true anatomical movement. When we take a look at a few particular teeth, we can see the teeth placement differences clearly, often leading to the need to perform a mid-course refinement. The yellow model is based on crown-only information, which is partial and incomplete information. The red teeth positioning are based on full anatomical data and true biomechanical movement. If you are relying on software that does not take advantage of full anatomical CT data and intelligent widget placement, you are guessing and estimating how the teeth will actually move. The discrepancy between the optical estimations versus the anatomical and biomechanical considerations is clear and is a very considerable cause for mid-course refinement cases.